It's a beautiful view to wake up to, wouldn't you say? I would say. I yeah. You have to agree. I could get used to that. The flips white balance is just cocked over the entire mountain range. Well, yeah, but you can see the mountain range. It looks okay. good. Yep, we're going on the donut hunt. I gotta fill my people in, so that's going on this morning. And then we're driving 680 miles, so uh, that should take about 12 hours, which will put us there at 7.32 p.m. And I believe that is the same time zone as what we're in now, mountain. Yeah, it is. Is it, mountain. or is it Pacific? That's well, mountain, I'm pretty sure. It's is it mountain? Okay. Pretty sure it's mountain. Bye. Oh my gosh, check this out, guys. I wish the flip could get the contrast between the mountains and the beautiful blue sky. This is awesome. I guess this is Copper Mountain here. Uh, it's uh, 42 degrees. <laughs> Very nice though. Beautiful. A few miles west of or uh, east of Vail at this point. Um, we just saw a sign. Our elevation is 10,662 feet. We've come down a little bit since then. But there's not much air up here. The X5 is still working pretty hard. But hey, we're, we're doing 70. Speed limit 65. We were just doing like 72. God, guys, this is incredible. I'm not used to this. But there's a truck runaway point. So if your brakes go, I guess you just steer on up in there. Huh. Try not to put her in the cabbage. Welcome to Vale. 8,600 feet above sea level. Check it out, boys. It's starting to get a little red. Freaking rates it is. Just absolutely beautiful. We're in 75 miles today. Um, I think our temperature has increased. 63 degrees. Look at this. We're not in Kansas anymore. Check it out. Freaking rates. I, I don't really know how to describe this. We've got Red Rock out there and, uh, yep, sand. I think this is part of the Colorado River. We just went over it a few minutes ago, so that means we're way west. Uh, we've been in the car about an hour. 721 mile range since we're going downhill. This is awesome. We've been going for an hour and the gas gauge has barely moved, so uh, still beautiful. A little less red rock now. And uh, we're, we've got the, the XM going. What do you think, Kevin? God, it's an education. We, sure. Yeah, we've got we've got a different kind of station on. It's very interesting. I mean, you're probably with one hill thing and one full. That's what I mean. It's a really amazing place. And the whole system. Yeah, th this is insane. It's it's like nothing I've ever seen before. Yeah, th this. Uh, Holy crap. We need a Ferrari through here. If Aaron would stick yeah. to these roads and just love it, we saw a California. Just love it, love it, love it. Well, we're on some sort of a little bridge here off the mountain, and I think I see a tunnel. Oh, yes! Oh my God, this is insane. It's a short one, but everybody loves a short, loud blast. Check it out. We're only doing 2,000 RPM. I don't want to waste any gas, and quite frankly, it's a lead leader in line six. But look at this. Look at this. That, that's insane. This is really, 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 really breathtaking through here. There's a lot of rocks. <laughs> there's a lot of rocks, and there's a river down there, and the eastbound traffic is on the other side of the river, and it's amazing. All right, ladies, gentlemen, we're holy crap. Somebody needs to wash their rig big times, but we are in Silt, Colorado right now. It is 9.20 in the morning, 76 degrees. We're in about um, 110 miles today. Feeling good. And it's still beautiful. We're not cutting through canyons anymore, but there's an old 60s Corvette. But check it out. We've got a big mountain there. And more there. Some over there. We're still on 70 West, of course. So uh, we'll, we'll talk to you later. Kenan said it right. We cannot describe this to you. If you want to appreciate the beauty of Western Colorado, you get on your damn horse and haul your fat ass out here and look at it. Is that a 747? It looks, it's got four engines, but it looks too small to be a 747. I don't know, that's, that's weird, but that would be uh, the airport here. 
And what's the name of the Grand Junction? There she goes. I don't want to lose the car, but it's up there somewhere. Yeah, so it is uh, 1026. We're at 86 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, we've driven about 200 miles. Lots of disco um, and amongst other things. And it's still beautiful out here. And as I said yesterday, we're doing well and we're making good time. And that's all we can ask for out here in the desert. Descending into the state of Utah soon, which is where we're going to spend a lot of our day today. But it's beautiful out here, 88 degrees, 11.30. We stopped at Denny's, got something to eat, had brunch in uh, Grand Junction, Colorado. So now we're going to keep chooching along and uh, enjoy these gorgeous views. We have just left the colorful state of Colorado and we're now in the state of Utah. So this uh, has never been in Utah before. Experience and it is really, 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 really beautiful. Now we're in uh, Green River, Utah, and that is the Green first River. little town I think we've seen since Denver. <laughs> no, not, not quite, but since Grand Junction, I guess. So, yeah, we're probably 100 miles out of there, or more than that, maybe 200 miles out of Grand Junction. Still beautiful, 96 degrees, 12.44 p.m., 3.94 left on the fuel. And here we go over the Green River. Oh my god, it's, it's actually green. green. It's actually a green. Okay, river. I understand. That's logic. I like that. Now we're in Emory County. Welcome. Flag bear nothingness into this. Just kind of. That appear. is awesome. We just. Wow. Yeah, this is intense out here. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Utah. Okay, now about, I don't know, 80 miles east of uh, Ridgefield, Utah. And the scenery has taken a bit of a change. We're kind of going through mountains again. We're up to about 7,500 or 8,000 feet. We were all the way down to 3,000 something, so now we've climbed almost a mile again. Um, guess what, we're doing well and we have plenty of gas, and that hasn't changed. We just saw a sign, uh, the next six miles is a 5% decline here, so we're gonna lose a lot of altitude, which will be good for gas mileage, but look at that view. Stunning, 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 stunning. What else can I say to describe that? I can't, get out of here, come look at this. This is amazing. Oh, that's cool, look at this. They cut the uh, mountain out totally around this thing here and then the eastbound lanes are just on the other side very neat so we're approaching the 15 merger if you know the 15 actually goes down to uh, like the San Diego area so maybe we should just hop on that right while we're out here and it comes up and touches this which is 70 uh, we're on 70 west so we're going to that and that'll put us near Las Vegas choices 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 Las Vegas 448 p.m. 92 degrees 71 miles an hour 189 miles to Las Vegas, Nevada. We're still in Utah. 90 degrees, uh, still in Utah. We should be in Arizona within an hour for a little bit. Uh, this is a little update. Starting to get some red rocks out there now. We had some 80 speed limits, which were nice. Uh, but now we're in the 75s, and that's fine too. Still mountains all around. It's beautiful. Vegas soon. Holy shit! Look at this. There's Walmart's distro center. That is massive. Look at the amount of trucks they got here. Wow. Freaking nice dickered. But number. look at the view they get. Number of trucks. I am glad I don't have to pay for any cooling of that building. Is it's 101 degrees. Where do the eagles sound better than in the mountains of Utah, Arizona, California, Nevada, Colorado even, even Colorado. Yeah, freaking right. Still in, uh, still in Utah though. And we're up to 103 degrees at 6.01 p.m. Mountain time. Arizona. Wow, immediately things have picked up. This is really beautiful. Now we're cutting through canyons. There's signs telling us to beware of strong crosswinds. So that means two hands on the wheel, including the camera. The camera hand is on the wheel. Can you test it? I mean, it's, hold on. There, that's better. So gorgeous. 419 miles of gas left. So we'll easily make it into the state of Nevada on that. We've got our Spanish guitars going on. Lovely. Lovely. I'll try these on for size. Look yeah. at these roads. This is absolutely nice beautiful. I believe, I believe we're still in Arizona. We have no service, so we can't check maps on the phones. I'm pretty sure we still are. Uh, yeah, we haven't seen a sign welcome to Nevada, but well, you know where we are. And this is absolutely intensive. Look at that. Look at that, that used to be a river. 
Well, it kind of still is. Oh, wow. Probably the Colorado River, actually. On the south side of those mountains over there, about 45 minutes, we would find the Grand Canyon if we were headed over there. But I flew over it last year, saw the Hoover Dam, and that was cool. But uh, now we are about 70 miles northeast of Las Vegas. It is 5.44 p.m. Pacific Coast time, the best time zone. And we've got beautiful roads as usual. Beautiful mountains, about 70 miles, 60, 50, northeast of Vegas, boys. 104 degrees, 6.02 p.m. local Pacific, beautiful. Between uh, 19 and 21 miles to Las Vegas, Nevada, 103 degrees. Windows are down because it's beautiful. Check it out, boys. Las Vegas. Hotels and strippers, as I was just saying. Looks like, uh, there we are, bring it right. As promised, we're listening to Yodlin stuff on the strip. I don't remember who he promised it to, or Bobby or Cole, I don't remember, but somebody. What have they done to the Venetian? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, not gonna make that way. It's called getting even for all the other Yeah, he's done that to us quite a few times across the country. No, seriously, the Venetian, oh my god, they've totally changed the Yes, sir. Things do take a change. 9 11 with the top up. Typical. Now you know where you are, yeah. Pacific Oh, look at that. Lights of. Just blows you. Yeah, there's an X6 over there. Chooching along. <laughs> BMW C Series! The BMW C Series. Uh, yeah, BMW C Series. <laughs> DiCarlo. Right. Oh, there's a Giardo over there. Yep. LG. Followed by a Z4. Which way do we want? I don't know. We could go north or south tonight and do the opposite tomorrow. It's up to you. Look at all of the iPhones. iPhones everywhere. It's changed a little bit since the last time I was in here, but it's still beautiful.